Sunfraser guards the Arch Dragon's Bridge. With a Dragon Slayer Great Bow, he stands on this ridge. Along comes a host with his Dark Moon in tow. With one single arrow to their death, both shall go. What? Right, you've asked for it now. Number 9. The host loses his lifeline. His white summon dies, however, be prepared for a surprise. Yorm the Giant, normally beaten with the Storm Ruler. However, this method by far is much cooler. By sacking buffs, you can acquire high damage, much more in fact, than Yorm can manage. <laughs> this walker invades deep in Lothric Castle, where he soon realises that two Sunbros are a hassle. One against three does not seem quite fair, yet he does not despair. He grows a pair, walks up some stairs, then a ladder, and onto the roof. Those warriors of sunlight did not watch the skies. The host sadly let down by both his allies. Normally, a great journey around the area is necessary, but all of that can be missed by running past the great beast and avoiding the tail. Needs the slight elevation and he will prevail. Next up is a gang spam. This host has been flanked by three invaders. Maybe it's just a prank. Actually, no, it's looking quite serious. They're getting out of hand. Yet always remember, a house divided cannot stand. He destroyed his team with a mighty thrust. Two things were lost here, health points and trust. Every parry is done with a 720 spin from behind, followed by the hay gesture combined with a praise the sun after every riposte. There's just no way this guy could have lost. Odd Starva and Top Waifu are attempting to make history. In the Cathedral of the Deep, they're solving a mystery. Aiming at a moving health bar alone is not easy, yet he sniped him with his very first attempt. Very cheeky. And we arrive at number one. This time it's the boss, Pontiff Sullivan. By forcing the boss into specific situations, he can predict what it will do without complications. Then, location plays an important part. Knowing where to stand, have to learn that off by heart. Oh yeah, and forget the rhyming for a second, he did all this at Soul Level 1 on New Game Plus with completely unupgraded weapons. <laughs>